Hello, this is your daily dose of medicine. In today's video, we are going to talk about kidney infections. And we are going to see symptoms, causes, treatment, diagnosis, complications, prevention, and lastly, home remedies. And before starting it, we can talk about some facts. Kidney infection, also known as a venal infection or pielonephritis. It is a common type of urinary tract infection and it affects estimated 3 to 4 men in every 10,000 men and in 15 to 17 in every 10,000 women. In most cases, oral antibiotics can successfully treat these infections and the symptoms we generally see are pain and discomfort in your sight, lower back, or around your genitals, high temperature, shivering or chills, feeling very weak or tired, and lastly loss of appetite. If you have any other urinary tract infection such as cystitis, you may have other symptoms. Pain or burning sensation when peeing, need to pee suddenly or more often than usual, Blood in your pee or smell your clothed pee. Pain in your lower tummy. There are some causes. It's generally caused by bacteria entering the urethra and reproducing in the bladder, then triggering the infection. And when it spreads to your kidneys, it will cause kidney infections. There are a number of ways in which the bacteria can achieve this. Toilet hygiene, weakened immune system, kidney stones are three of them and lastly female physiology also important because woman's urethra is shorter and it's making easier to bacteria reach your kidneys. And in kidney stones, individuals with kidney stones have a high risk of developing kidney infections. This is E. coli and Kidney infection usually caused by uh, E. coli get into your urethra, then travel up to your bladder and causing cystitis, then up to your kidneys. That causes generally kidney infections. And how we can die? Generally, we choose urine analysis and urine culture, but doctors also may use rectal examination for males. And CT scan, MRI, and ultrasound, and that will provide images of your kidneys. And this is a CT scan of kidney infections. And how can we treat this? Your doctor will probably prescribe antibiotics, and which you may need for a week or two. If you have severe infection, you will need to stay in the hospital and get antibiotics intravenously through a needle. If your kidney infections keep coming back, there might tract with the structure of your urinary tract. These types of issues often need surgery. And there are some home remedies we can talk about. Drink plenty of fluids to flush out germs. When you go to bathroom, sit on the toilet instead of squatting over it, which can keep your bladder from completely empty. Use a heating pad on your belly, back or side. There are some complications. You may permanently damage your kidneys, leading to chronic kidney disease or rarely kidney failure. Bacteria from kidneys uh, could poison your bloodstream, causing life-threatening sepsis, and you may develop renal scarring or high blood pressure. How to prevent it? Urinate as soon as you need to. Avoid delaying urination when you feel to urge to urinate. Empty the bladder after interco intercourse and wipe carefully. Don't use deodorant sprays or douches on your genitals. And that wraps up all the video. Consider liking, commenting, sharing with your friends. Thanks for watching.